Welcome back into News Channel 10 Sports. I, of course, am Zach Woodard, live here from Friona. I mean, look at this crowd. Give it up for yourselves, guys. Wow. I mean, what an amazing response to coming out here. One big thing to be excited about in this city is the Friona Chieftains football team. Give it up for the Friona Chieftains football team. It's a brand new season for him. A new chance for head coach Elias Creo to get a full season under his belt after taking over halfway last year. And although it's summertime, the Chieftains are doing everything that they can to get ready for this upcoming season. A lot of our kids, they work throughout the day. Some of them leave at 5 o'clock in the morning. Um, they go to the dairies. They go to the fields and all that stuff. So we kind of move our practices late in the afternoon to give them a chance to kind of get home, get something to eat, and then come over here and do football. We have a system that was, but was put in place way before I was. Even here, um, you know, a lot of these kids have gone through the system. Their parents have gone through the system. And so there's a lot of support from the community. And so that also helps because it gets their kids here, and these kids have a chance to build that team chemistry and be a part of what it takes to be a Friona Chieftain. A lot of our kids, they do powerlifting. They do football. We use a lot of the same kids. We share a lot. They're around each other a lot. It builds that team chemistry, and then it gets them out here. They, they want to be out here. They want to have fun. It's honestly the best experience I've ever had since I was a little kid. You know, I just from being up in the stands, wanting to be one of the chieftains, from being one of the chieftains is the best feeling in the world. Oh, it's just awesome seeing everybody in the stands, you know. Everyone, the whole, it's, nice, it's, it's nice and beautiful seeing the community, community come together and just enjoy the night together. You look up in the stands, you hear, you hear the fight song, you hear the crowd cheering. You know, this year we were able to bring out some of the little ones, the little chiefs. They were able to run out. They, they're awesome. They line up when we're walking in. I mean, everything that we've ever needed, the community has backed us up and supported. A lot of it was just we had a couple of young guys that had to step up, and we had to get some team chemistry going. And once we got that going, they were able to start believing and trusting each other and trusting the offense and the defense. I expect better teamwork, better uh, responsibilities, and, you know, we have some young people coming up. And we have a few seniors on the, the team, but uh, I, I just expect uh, more from everybody, which will happen. My expectations are that we all we come out here and we compete with every every team that we play, you know. And I believe that every guy that that plays, you know, they can give it their all.